Let's go. See you on site. You'll, you'll understand a little more what I'm talking about, I think, with the um, with the with the 500 ordeal. <laughs> small wood it's wonderful in big wood it is it is it is wonderful it's a good good saw and uh but you know that that's that's not the world we live in at all times so and i look for an all-around saw when i'm when i'm out and not everybody's cutting trees down all day and in the buck steady all day so this will make a little more sense to people when you watch what happens here. Um, especially here with Joe's saw. It, it's kind of, it's just the design of the saw. It's a 359 with a big bore on it. So it's going to, it's going to wick up a little quicker and it's going to, well, it doesn't have a, it's not fuel injected, plain and simple. Um, so I'm going to buck, go around, do a little bit of playing around, carry you guys around with me and just show you what, I kind of look for in a saw, what I like in a saw. So this thing's ready to go. It, it's a good power saw. I'm just gonna dice up that cedar right there, maybe chase over to that little fir. Probably should take off this because I'm gonna heat up pretty quick. 359, big bore, Dino Joe. saw so I don't want to lean it out too much but it's a very nice running saw if you want to if you want to go back to the 500 footage I was standing right there cutting with the 500 that one day <laughs> So I think Dino Joe will trust me on this. I just dig out a little jet driver here. And uh, I just heard a, just a, a team, this is a sharp chain, friend, so it should, well, I just give this a slight tweak on the high jet.
I'm really liking this little saw. little saw very nice little saw I like that little saw I like it a lot but it is a little saw friends it's small so there's a hundred ways to skin the cat pick one and do whatever you like afford to change my direction by six or eight feet I change direction by going a little deeper over on this close side Dutchman's are a no-no there is a thing called a working Dutchman we do use them that's something I've never taught because it is a fail it's a zero on the stump friends do you remember yesterday when I talked about my cuts not meeting up on that second tree we cut yesterday's video right and how I chose to make the decision to just squeak it, make it a little bit longer so that the cuts would meet up. Usually what happens is you'll you'll come in too short. That can happen and you, you create a Dutchman and you clean it out. Well, going long is the opposite. And I did it in yesterday's video and I actually interjected and talked about it. I was able to change direction, but where I was aiming is the break, right where we're at. So see where the tree ended up? So I just want this to click for you guys to understand what you can turn. There's no need to use silly little Dutchman's and this and that. That's why we clean our trees out. Dutchman's are, uh, uh, we have used working Dutchman's. Absolutely, I've used working Dutchman's. This is no place for a dirty stump. Structures, around structures. Dutchman's can also fail and not work. So you don't you don't use Dutchman's around residential tree work. It makes no sense to me. See that? There's my buck. That's what I was shooting for. So I'm not covering this whole freaking area. You're
turn that off, right? All these, see there's, there's something right there. Okay, we're gonna grab a different saw. This is the perfect opportunity to grab a different saw, friends, because uh, I, I got a couple more trees to cut down. I wanna try that Dalmar. Uh, I got a freaking sweat on. I am living life right now like you wouldn't believe the feeling I got running through my veins right now. It's unexcribable, but I'm sore. I am, look at some dead ones there too. This thing's, Donnie, beautiful man, bring back memories, buddy. But now it's time to tune it. You guys hear that? It broke in a bit now. It needs a little tune on the idle, maybe a squeak on the high jet. Seriously, that's how it goes. It's looking good, looking real good. I'm gonna try this Dolmar, friends. Okay, let's try this Dolmar. I'll try it in the box and then I'll know whether it'll be okay for cutting trees. We got a group there, we gotta get another big one there. I want to try this Dalmar in the wood. I know what my XPW does, but see the buck, we're right on a limb here. See that limb at the bottom there? That's tough bucking through them limbs. So what I may do, it's a 16 footer, I already know that, but I go 16.6. So now I got snipe either way. I might just snip on the inside of this limb here, which will put that at about a 16.3, which will still be 16 feet. You see what I'm saying, friends? or just buck through the knot, whatever. Let's see what happens here with this dolly. Hear that? I'm gonna actually give it the slightest bit of slow choke. Bowlers need their freaking saws to start now. I was two poles, Kenzie's. I've always been impressed here. This muffler's haywire, but I'm excited about it. I'm gonna go knock some wood over.
might cut with this saw. Mm-hmm. <sighs> beautiful, beautiful day out, friends. Um, just to recap, um, that Dalmar, Kenzie's buddy, I know you're probably watching. Uh, I'm so glad that you found all those parts and got that saw made for me, buddy. It's a beauty. There was a couple times there we're just getting to learn. Friends, that is 32 inches of full house hand file EXL. Organ chain. Love organ. Organ is nice out of the box, friends. Just remember all these chains that when they come out of the box, right? You got to sooner or later, right? This is 730 seconds files, brand new organ file. You got to get the freaking gullet. So I, I don't think it, you know, it's nice to pull something out of the box and, and have it cut. There's no doubt about it. I mean, that's what you want. But essentially, essentially, as soon as you hit something, you're filing. So it's you. It's on you. I want to thank everybody, sincerely actually, for popping into buckandbillyray.com and shopping at our store. <clears throat> Seriously, thank you. Friends, it's been eight years of just doing our thing. And we've done, we did a small little thing with Weaver. Remember, you probably even don't. It was such a long time ago. We had a link in, in the thing for the little fallen pouch. Nick's boots and Ripsaw. Three, three people. Products that we've supported and companies we've supported. It feels so good, friends, to me to, to be able to just keep the, the channel, just, you know what I mean? Just, just, I just do. Everybody's different. It's my channel, right? I have you. I have you to thank for coming here and watching. Who remembers the beginning when I used to welcome every single freaking subscriber on a Sunday? I used to do it every Sunday. I would list the new subscribers. And I would thank them. So it, it just means that much to me. It always has. And I believe that's how you build community. You talk to people. You acknowledge people. You know what I'm saying, Laura Rose? Hey, Gaines. Gainesies, I haven't seen you for a little bit. I hope you're feeling all right, buddy. Hey, Barry Richardson. These are Thomas. <laughs> Anyways, I'm just, I'm just feeling better and but the store i wanted to talk about that for two seconds we have we have two new items the one we just put up i did a freaking i did a a, a community post yesterday friends you know I, I i'm gonna do more of those i think and you people with our new hoodie which is actually right here. Um, you, you guys went over and, and supported and, and purchased it. To you people, whoever you were, thank you. Sincerely, it helps us a ton, friends. So thank you all so much. Listen, I beak, I ramble, we know this. The Dalmar, we go into a patch tomorrow. Friends, I got so much other guy. I got some fi more filing videos already logged, ready to go. Some stuff about when you first put a chain on. And you go cut for a bit and you dust it up a little. You know what I mean? All of a sudden, you just it's not got that bite. I show you a way to just, I call it a maintenance filing or just a get back on job, get back to the cutting filing. That's it. This thing's been, it's been fluff. It's been fluff. See, I got a little carried away on that one. There we go. There's my burr. This is the first filing. Not a training. Not a training. You can train your 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 uh, chain right off the hop if you want. But if it's that scenario where you got to get back to cutting right away, I can show you a quick little thing which I always do on a, on a brand new chain if I'm hand filing. Let me know in the comments how in the heck you're feeling and how you're liking things. Just let's just start. BSing. 
Throw in some comments out there. Fill up the comment section. Friends, give us a thumbs up. Go to Buck and Billy Ray Freakin.com skis. Pick up yourself a toy can I show it. Whack the slaves off her. Rip on the cord and step up and buck, would ya? Friends, I love yous. Work hard, be honest, and be kind. Over and out.